This is breaking news from KCCI 8 News. Good evening. There is breaking news right now at 10 as rescue crews once again searching for two children this time who are missing in the Des Moines River. It's all happening right now in Fort Dodge. KCCI's Ryan Smith is live on the scene tonight. Kevin and Stacy, that's right. Witnesses called for help after spotting two kids venture into the river behind me. They went underwater and just feet from where I'm standing, I'm told they reportedly never resurfaced. Now, this portion of the river right now is above flood stage. I want to give you a visual behind me uh, just to show you um, how swollen these waters are. If you can see these power poles behind us here, the base of those power poles are underwater right now. Rescue crews suspended search efforts about a half hour ago due to nightfall. The kids were last seen in the water just south of the Kenyon Road Bridge at 7 o'clock tonight. Fort Dodge officials issued a warning today about dangerous water levels here on the river of the Des Moines River and swift currents clocking in at 19 miles per hour. The National Weather Service reported the river is at 15 feet currently. That's 5.3 feet above flood stage. Multiple agencies scoured the water by boat, an aircraft, and of course, a search along the shoreline for about two and a half hours this evening. We want to account for these uh, kids and hopefully they got out safely. But again, at this time, it's still a uh, uh, rescue effort. Now, so far tonight, there has been no reports filed for missing children. The fire chief also told me that he hopes these two kids were able to make their way somehow out of the river water, and but does promise that crews will be back at it full force starting first thing in the morning. Ryan Smith reporting live from Fort Dodge tonight. Thanks, Ryan.